Welcome to Learn Yourself. Now let us understand some of the questions based on altitude. So first question is how many altitudes can a triangle have? So here I have shown you one figure. Let us take this as triangle A, B and C. And we have here three altitudes. For vertex A, the AE is uh, an altitude. For vertex B, the BG is an altitude. For vertex C, the CD will be an altitude. So three altitudes will be there for a triangle. So our answer here is three. Question number two, draw rough sketches of altitude from A, that is vertex to BC, that is line segment for the following triangles. We have acute angle triangle, right angle triangle and obtuse angle. So what is an altitude? An altitude has a one end point at a vertex of a triangle and other on the line containing opposite side. So here vertex is going to be A and opposite side line segment will be BC. So we have to draw altitude from A vertex to BC line segment. Now altitude will be always a straight line. So it will going to make a right angle at opposite side. This is important characteristic of altitude that you have to remember that once it is coming out from the vertex, it is touching the opposite side and there it is making right angle because altitude is always a straight line. Now let us go back to our numerical. For acute angle triangle from vertex A, it has to join the opposite line segment BC and here it will make a right angle. So this we are giving a name that is AE. So AE will be our altitude for acute angle triangle. Now right angle triangle. Now for right angle triangle as we can see from A the line is passing and it is touching the line segment BC. And this is right angle. So AC line that is of triangle is itself an altitude for right angle triangle. So AC here is an altitude for right angle triangle. It is on the triangle. Now for obtuse angle triangle, we have to extend this line segment that is B BC and we can draw a straight line coming out of the vertex A. And that is going to make a right angle at BC. So AE here is an altitude for obtuse angle triangle. Now here if you will see for acute angle triangle the altitude is inside. Now for right angle triangle it is on the triangle. And for the obtuse angle triangle it is outside the triangle. So this will be our answer for acute angle triangle A will be an altitude for right angle triangle AC will be an altitude and for obtuse angle triangle the AD will be an altitude. Question number three will an altitude always lie in the interior of a triangle if you think that this need not be true draw a rough sketch to show such a case. So here I have shown six different triangles. Based on angle, acute angle triangle, right angle triangle, obtuse angle triangle. Based on sides, equilateral, isosceles and scalene triangles are there. So let us take first case. In acute angle triangle as we can see the AE is an altitude and it is inside the triangle. It is in interior region of the triangle. So one of our answer will be acute angle triangle because an altitude is inside the triangle. Now our second case is right angle triangle. So here altitude is side itself that is AC. So AC is on the triangle. It is not in the interior region of the triangle. Now for obtuse angle triangle AD is our altitude and which is outside the triangle. Now our fourth case is equilateral triangle. Here it is in the interior region of the triangle. For isosceles also it is in the interior region of the triangle and for ice, for scalene also it is in the interior region of the triangle. So we can mention here 
the acute angle and we can also mention here equilateral isosceles and scalene triangle that their altitudes will be in the interior region of the triangle. Fourth numerical. Can you think of a triangle in which two altitudes of triangle are two of its sides? So, first case is acute angle triangle. So, here from vertex A till BC, it is an altitude and it is not the side. For second case, it is right angle triangle. Here, as you can see, the line is coming from the vertex A, touching the line segment BC, and it is on the triangle and it is itself it is a side of a triangle so here the first side ac is an altitude of a triangle and other side that is bc is also an altitude of a triangle because here it is coming out of b and it is touching the line segment ac this vertical line if we will extend then it is touching the line segment ac so it is making right angle over here. So BC is also an altitude. So here two altitudes are there. Other than hypotenuse, the two sides will be an altitude for the right angle triangle. So AC and BC, they both will be the altitude for right angle triangle. Now for obtuse angle triangle, AD will be the altitude for the triangle and it will be outside the triangle. So, for equilateral triangle, isosceles triangle and scalene triangle, the line will be in the interior region of the triangle and none of their sides will be an altitude. So, our answer is right angle triangle where two of its sides other than hypotenuse will be the altitudes for this triangle. Fifth question is, can the altitude and median be same for a triangle? So we have to check for each and every case of the triangle that equilateral triangle, isosceles triangle, scalene triangle, acute angle, right angle and obtuse angle. So here I have shown altitude for each and every triangle. For equilateral triangle, yes, altitude and median will be same because all sides are same here. So for equilateral triangle only, the altitude and median will be same. You can see in isosceles triangle, as you can see here, in this case, that median and altitude is not same. This is not a midpoint of opposite side. So, altitude and median are not same in isosceles. Then, in scalene triangle, median and altitude here also will not be the same. As you can see, if from this vertex, if I'll draw a straight line, then it will go till it will go till here, and it is not connecting the midpoint of opposite side. So, this case also, in this case also, the median and altitude will not be seen. Then, acute angle triangle. As you can see, this is not a midpoint. So, th in this case also, the median and altitude will not be seen in acute angle. In right angle triangle, the side itself will be the altitude. So, in this case also, it is not the case. The altitude and median will not be seen in obtuse angle. The altitude will lie in the exterior region of the triangle. So, median and altitude will not be same in obtuse angle triangle. So, we have only here equilateral triangle in which the median and altitude will be same. So, thank you for watching and learning with us. If you have any doubt, please comment down below. I'll see you in next video. Till then, keep learning, keep sharing. And don't forget to subscribe, learn yourself.